The following is a presentation of National Speed Sport News. Tonight on Speed Sport Magazine, an exclusive interview with Tony Stewart, who pays respect to wing sprint cars and to those that race them. There's nothing lower about it. You can go beat those guys. You've done more than winning the nationwide race, in my opinion. And as we prepare for the biggest wing sprint car race of the year, we'll check in on last weekend's 24th annual 360 Knoxville Nationals from Iowa, as well as a much smaller version, Micro Sprints, from the High Banks Hustle in Illinois. Plus, we'll have the conclusion to our in-depth conversation with one of the most successful and respected NHRA drag racers of all time, the outspoken Shirley Muldowney. It's going to be a rocky ride, so buckle up. Speed Sport Magazine starts now. Hi, everybody, and welcome to Speed Sport Magazine. I'm your host, Ralph Shaheen. Tonight, we'll hear passionate and candid conversations from two American racing legends, Tony Stewart and Shirley Muldowney. You definitely don't want to miss those. But first, we want to head out to Knoxville, Iowa, where the biggest 360 wing sprint car race of the year took place this past weekend. The 24th annual 360 Knoxville Nationals. Racing kicked off on Thursday with Davey Heskin in the red 56 taking command of the race, but he had to hold off a hard charging Jason Johnson in the white 41 on the final lap to secure the opening night victory. His first 360 win at the famed track. On to Friday for night number two. The 13 of Mark Dobmeyer on the high side took the early lead, but lost the top spot to the one car of Sammy Swindell on lap number nine. Dob Meyer stayed close, mounting a spirited challenge in the final laps and pulled even with the leader. But in the end, it was Swindell that got to the finish line first. And now to the main event on Saturday. With $10,000 and a 360 Knoxville Nationals crown on the line, Brian Brown in the white and red 21 had more than enough incentive to bring his A game to the A main. In his 15th start in the event, he was still looking for his first victory which he earned Saturday by leading flag to flag without serious challenge. Oh, it feels great, man. Just uh, to, for 13 years, be coming here and had some bad luck one way or the other and to be able to pull it off tonight in front of all of our friends, family, and all of our sponsors is just uh, pretty special. So uh, tickled to death. Just uh, probably the biggest win of my career and there's probably only one that can, can, can do that one. That's probably next Saturday. So uh, looking forward to that also. This week, the track will host the 410 wing sprints in the sport's most prestigious race of the year, the 54th annual Knoxville Nationals. For tickets, visit KnoxvilleRaceway.com. Up next on Speed Sport Magazine, Tony Stewart talks about his return to sprint car racing, and Smoke speaks to the critics who feel that he shouldn't. I love racing. That's what I want to do. So if that, if wanting to race is wrong, then what, what am I here for? Since 1934, National Speed Sport News has been America's motorsports authority. Every month, Speed Sport Magazine comes alive with stunning photography, insightful commentary, and in-depth features. You will get the full story with Speed Sport Magazine. To start your home delivery of America's motorsports authority, log on to nationalspeedsportnews.com and hit the big yellow subscribe button. Be the fan in the know. Just go to nationalspeedsportnews.com and click subscribe. 